Hey, this is Amber from the Hectic Homemaker. We're back at our green cleaning event, and I'm going to show you how to make a carpet purifier and what that actually is. So how many of you have ever bought the carpet fresheners from the store? So when you use those, it's like really strong. It makes you kind of want to pass out a little bit. This is not that. This is the same concept where you're going to freshen upholstery carpets. This is going to be bad. I got a really good idea though. We'll do it over the way. So all you're going to do for this is take a jar. I like the quart because then I don't have to make it all the time. I can just kind of do it once a month or whatever. You can use this to sprinkle on your mattresses to freshen them up, um, furniture, whatever really. So purification is great for eliminating odors. That's kind of what its purpose is. So diffusing it to eliminate odors. Um, you can put it like on little cotton pads and put it places. This I actually sprinkle like in the bottom of the diaper pail in the bottom of my garbage cans. And then I'll just vacuum it out when I'm vacuuming in those rooms every couple of weeks. So I usually do like 10 drops of purification to half of a quart. And then I just add a little more so it's not so much stirring. Oh my god, this is so messy. At home, I just do it over the sink because, again, I'm not very clean at this. So purification can get kind of expensive and it tends to go out of stock a lot because it is so popular. You can get a bottle of lemongrass for about $11. So I actually use a lot more lemongrass, which is in purification. So you can just add half and half or do all of one or the other. Um, my dryer balls, when I do my laundry and stuff, I tend to do lemongrass because it doesn't really go out of stock and it smells just as refreshing as purification. So again, you got your chopstick that you got for free. You can just stir that up a little bit. And now what I do is we punch holes in the lid of the jar so you can just put it on and go about sprinkling it let it sit five ten minutes on your carpet before you vacuum if you have dogs your vacuum cleaners stink right everybody yes so it'll freshen your vacuum cleaner freshen your floors it makes your house smell really light and springy so in north dakota for us it's awesome because we can't really open our windows and stuff in the winter so this way it's this like really faint fresh smell that is kind of awesome. So then I keep mattresses another too. mattresses. Mm -hmm. I think I said that, didn't oh, I? Probably. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I did, but it's cool, whatever. You can sprinkle it on your mattresses and vacuum it off too to freshen those up. And then you just take another lid and put it over the top. So when you're not using it, it's not gonna lose its scent or spill all over the place. So there you have that DIY freshener.